Uh, my name is Russell Harvey. I'm a manager of supply chain for Piedmont Rockdale Hospital in Conyers. And what does that job usually entail? Like, what are you, what are you doing on a day to day? It's um, it's purchasing items for the hospital, keeping make sure all the nursing areas are supplied with their areas. I have a staff that um, they refill car areas every day. Any kind of special orders go through me or my staff, so we make sure they have you know like if they need something special in OR. We also handle mail distribution. Um, we handle crash carts, um, intubation boxes, stuff like that. So on a day to day, we're here making sure the hospitals stock with what they need basically and how has this coronavirus changed what you do on a day-to-day -day? it's made it a little more challenging i mean it's still basically the same but we were lucky i mean before it started we were already having meetings pre-planning meetings so we had ppe personal protective equipment ordered and in stock here on a natural power disaster so once we just didn't know when the, when it was going to hit and with the uncertainty of that when it hit i mean it hit pretty hard pretty quick here but now we have, um, we still get our, we get a distribution center truck daily, Monday through Friday um, from Piedmont Distribution Center in downtown. They have the majority of our supplies that we need for the PPE equipment during this conversion. But we also order from other vendors. Um, we get, you know, FedEx, UPS deliveries every day. So those come in and we make sure that um, we've even started working on weekends during when it got really bad to make sure that the nursing units had everything they needed and um, that we stayed stopped. This is such a, it's taking such a toll on, on everybody um, regardless, but really the medical community and what you guys are doing, just kind of what, what's keeping you going? Why do you have so much pride in what you do? You got to have pride, take pride in your job to, to go in oh. on a day to day. Oh yeah, well I've been, I've been at Piedmont Rockdale or, Rock, or Rockdale Medical Center for over 20 something years. I mean, I grew up in Rockdale. It's like family to me. And, the staff's family. I mean, we treat patients like they're part of our family. So to me, I mean, I want to make sure that's like my family member. I want to make sure they have what's needed. I'll come in on weekends. I'll do whatever's needed to do to make sure that patient, that nurse, that doctor has the equipment they need. I mean, it's, it's one big family. Now, Russell, I'm a, I'm a sports guy usually. Uh, things, things are looking a little bit different for me these days also. But we hear you're a tech fan. I see the Georgia Tech uh, over your shoulder there. Why are you such yeah. a big fan? Uh, I'm, when I was brought up, my parents, they were really big tech fans. My mom had a job down near the campus. Um, so when I went there, oh, Jeff Collins. I actually went to school. We went to high school together, uh, Coach Collins and I. No way. Yeah. I even, what's even, up, Russell? What's up, Jeff? Uh, good to see you, up. man. You too, man. I even remember it uh, fall, all day this year. I brought my yearbook and you signed it from 19. Yep. Hey, yep. Absolutely. Yeah, th uh, they sent me a thing of all, all that you're doing, man. Just uh, means a lot. Just really proud of you. And uh, we go way back. And uh, ju I just think it's really cool that everything that you're doing for the community, uh, everything you're doing uh, to keep us all healthy and safe, man, it's really, really positive. Thank you. I appreciate this. He got me with this. One. Yeah, <laughs> I like the I like the, uh, the backdrop, too. You like it? You know. That. I had to make sure. I mean, I've even got the, the picture from Fall Day and a couple of the autographs. So I'm I right. Can... Thank you. Thanks for all you do. Hey, we got to get out there, uh, get out there in a couple months, right? I hope so. <laughs> you and me both. <laughs> How cool was that? That was great. I, that was shocker. Woo. I'm, I'm sweating now. <laughs> Oh, well, you had some friends that, that nominated you and uh, thought that you might, might enjoy that, so. Definitely. That was great. I appreciate that.